Hello and welcome everyone. My name is Vivek Bhandari. Uh, I'm head of product management at Area One Security, and uh, and welcome to this uh, really exciting webinar today, where we are introducing our Paper Fish uh, program. And uh, all of us here at Area One are really excited because this is a truly innovative offering, a first in the security industry that really puts accountability uh, on the vendor, which is Area One in this case, to make sure that we. Uh, you know, are, are stopping the phishing attacks that uh, that are coming at you as as the customer. So let's dive straight into the details. Uh, you probably already know what Area One's mission is, but if you don't, really, let me give you a quick 20 second primer on that. Um, Area One's mission is to stop phishing attacks, and why? Why the laser focus on phishing? Because if you look at the history of all the breaches, almost every the breach has begun uh, with a successful phishing attack. That is the easiest way of all the attack mechanisms uh, that the attackers go at their targets. Phishing is the most easiest and successful way uh, to be able to successfully get to the target, right? And a lot of these ultimately result in a breach and cause significant damage, loss of information, brand erosion, and everything else. Um, and, and what's fascinating is really it is the... Um, that 1%, less than 1% of that traffic that really is of that phishing nature, but it causes almost 100% of the damage. Uh, and that is why we are so focused on stopping these phishing attacks preemptively and making sure that these attacks are never successful and never cause um, the security havoc and issues that customers face today. All right. Um, and the reason these uh, phishing attacks are getting into your environment today um, it, even past the existing defenses are because the existing defenses that have been built over the last 10, 15, 20 years are really not geared to look for these low volume targeted and phishing attacks that are coming at, uh, coming at customers, right? So for example, on the email security platforms, the anti-filter uh, scanning and, and, and filtering out that mechanism, it does the, the email gateways do a fantastic job of filtering out the spam and the commodity threats uh, but the low volume phishing attacks get through. User education can help reduce the click through rate, but even the most successful user awareness and education um, endeavors result in pretty high percentage of users still clicking through and falling for these phishing attacks. And it frankly hampers productivity. So those are not very effective. Uh, and lastly, our perimeter defenses that we have in place today, like the firewalls and the proxies and the IPSs, while they do a great job for the functions they were built, they are not really meant for stopping these phishing attacks. And that results in these phishing attacks getting through the environment uh, and causing all the challenges that we see today. Now, the way Area 1 approaches this problem is a very preemptive approach. So Area 1 scans the entire Internet looking for phishing campaigns and phishing infrastructure before these get used in phishing attacks. And that's why it's of the preemptive nature. And the way we do it is, Attackers always need infrastructure, whether it is compromised infrastructure, lease infrastructure. They need infrastructure uh, to launch these phishing attacks. And it's all about tracking the entire Internet for phishing infrastructure very proactively uh, with the help of high-speed Internet crawlers and network sensors, looking for those uh, bad sites, domains, and uh, IP addresses that are getting used or stood up. And then taking decisive action through using our automated platforms across all traffic, whether it is email traffic, web traffic, or network traffic, to stop these phishing attacks preventatively going at our, our customer's environment. And that's how Area 1 really operates. Now, if you look at it as an example, right, Area 1 takes actions across all traffic, email, web, and network. Now, email is obviously one of the primary sources of these phishing attacks coming uh, coming at customers, and uh, uh, what Area 1 really focuses on is those low-volume phishing attacks that evade the high-volume detection techniques that are used by the secure email gateways. Um, you know, so the spam filtering and all of that stuff is taken care of by, you know, either the cloud email platform or the secure email gateway, uh, but those low-volume phishing attacks is what really Area 1 focuses on and helps filter that out from getting into the, uh, the inboxes of the users. Uh, it is super simple to deploy because Area 1 is very easy to deploy and just can, uh, it's flexible, it can sit in before or after a secure email gateway, uh, works really well with cloud inbox platforms like Google and Microsoft, um, and it literally is 
you know, super easy to deploy where most of our deployments uh, happen in 10 to 15 minutes at tops, right? So that makes it very easy. The other thing that happens with the area one deployment, especially when it comes to email, uh, is that we don't hold any emails. It's an inline detection engine um, making it operationally very efficient and very fast while allowing you as the customer to leverage your existing quarantine platform uh, to quarantine off the detections by Area 1. Uh, it's a similar story on the web and the network side. Area 1 has created flexible options in terms of how we stop phishing activity on the web and the network side with the help of our web DNS service, uh, the integrations with the DNS platforms, uh, or the integrations that we have built, the automated integrations that we have built with Tier 1 Edge platforms like web proxies and firewalls and next generation firewalls. Now, uh, you know, I wanted to share with you a couple of uh, examples from live customer environment, and these are all Fortune 500 companies that are that are leveraging Tier 1 solutions, best of breed solutions at their edge um, for their secure email gateway for sandboxing content. And the detection examples that you're seeing on your screen are the phishing attacks that are getting past all those defenses today and that Area 1 is catching and stopping from getting to the user's inbox. In this example, this is a LinkedIn phish. It's a credential harvester uh, that bypassed the secure email gateway with all the advanced features turned on. It went right past uh, the sandboxing platform, uh, and Area 1 was able to intercept and stop this uh, particular phish from getting through. Uh, DocuSign is another example on this slide. As you can see, it's very popularly used out there, um, and uh, the DocuSign brand gets used very, very um, uh, often for phishing attacks. And in this case, as you can see, the email gets through. It has a link in there, and the link is actually taking the user out to a malicious site, uh, which obviously does not belong to DocuSign. And the last example here is, you know, you, a very popular brand, again, that, uh, you know, gets used very often in phishing activity. Uh, obviously, Apple is a big brand out there, and in this case, as you can see, it's a fake email with a, with a fake Apple receipt that goes to the user's inbox uh, with the link in there, and, you know, quite often users see, like, okay, wait a second, I didn't really have those transactions. They click on that link, and that's that's when they fall for the fish. But in this case, Area 1 was able to identify the phishing activity, and Area 1's built uh, a lot of uh, detections on the back end, whether it is, you know, crawling the Internet, whether it is analyzing all the aspects of the email using techniques like machine learning and computer vision to really identify those low-volume phishing attacks and stop them from, from becoming successful. Uh, okay, so on to the, the key uh, topic of today's presentation, which is really pricing. Uh, you know, we've come a long way as an industry in terms of, uh, you know, how the pricing has evolved over time, especially when it comes to infrastructure as a service or cloud platforms as a service. We see uh, you know, obviously the big platforms like Google and Amazon have really blazed the trail in terms of creating utility-based pricing, right? You can use the, the awesome power of the cloud and only pay for what you're using. Well, it's time for the security industry to really evolve to that pricing model. And, you know, we are really thrilled here at Area 1 to be, be the leaders and the first in this space to offer uh, a pricing model that really fits to that uh, to that same paradigm where the customers only pay for the value uh, that they're getting and it puts the accountability on Area 1. Uh, and obviously, Area 1 has this pricing model where it is uh, aligned to the value the customer is seeing based on the phishing blocks that we, we are able to provide across all the traffic. And there is really no per user or per device or a location-based or a mailbox-based uh, or web traffic-based pricing. It's a flat pricing uh, directly tied into the number of phishing blocks that Area 1 is able to provide in the customer environment. Um, so let's look into the details of this program. I mean, the program, obviously, it's just pay per fish, and as it means, uh, the customers literally pay only $10 per phishing detection. The beauty of this program is if you have, uh, you know, defense in depth deployed with all the great solutions you already have in the environment today and are dealing with phishing attacks getting through, it's a great way to leverage Area 1 to, to layer in the defense um, against phishing attacks and only pay for the detections and the catches that Area 1 provides. Uh, there is no time or dollar commitment, so you as a customer can decide you only want to use it for a certain duration and not use it for the other time. That's totally fine. There are no contractual obligations there. Um, and if you continue to use and there are big phishing attacks that are getting through your existing defenses, 
and area one is catching a lot of these, uh, there is pricing protection built in because you are capped at the uh, at the ELA price, which is the fixed price for for the enterprise, and that ensures that you, you as the customer are not going to be on an unlimited liability in terms of the payments. Uh, once you hit a certain cap, uh, you you don't pay any additional for any additional detections uh, for that particular year. Um, and so, as you can see, it's super simple and very easy to leverage. Uh, in addition to whatever you're using in your environment today. Uh, the benefits of the program, obviously it's, it's, it's a very quick and easy way without having to spend a lot of budget upfront and commit to it. It's a very easy way to sort of augment your existing defenses and stop those phishing attacks from getting through across your email, web, and network traffic. Um, and uh, we, we do have plenty of uh, inflexible deployment options uh, on the email side, either as the MX record or a, or a hop after the MX or on the web and network side, like I said earlier, uh, there are multiple options, either by leveraging the Area 1 DNS service, the recursive DNS service, integration with the DNS servers, or integration with the uh, existing Tier 1 Edge platforms like uh, web proxies and next generation firewalls. Um, now, for customers who are wondering, like, okay, great, I love this price for a uh, paper fish pricing model, and uh, you know, you know, what else do we have? Is there a pricing option which allows us to lock in the price uh, for a longer term? And the answer is absolutely yes. Uh, you can start with the paper fish model. And uh, as you start seeing the value and see that it's, uh, you know, it's time to maybe switch over to a fixed price model, you certainly have that option. We simply call that as the fixed price ELA. And that allows you to um, have a more uh, uh, substantial saving uh, and, and, and lock in for a longer term as well, right? It gives you more options in terms of support as well as more flexibility on the, on the MSA terms. Um, so it's, uh, it's certainly an option for all customers. All right. So in, uh, in closing, uh, you know, area one, you can certainly leverage it using the paper fish model today. Uh, you certainly get pricing protection as you start with the paper fish model. You are capped at the ELA price. It's super easy and fast to deploy with no operational overhead on an ongoing basis. Uh, and it's comprehensive, which is stop phishing activity across all traffic, uh, email, web, and network. With that, that brings us uh, to the closing. Thank you so much for your time. For additional details, you can certainly go to that URL, area1security.com slash pay per fish as one word. Uh, and we look forward to engaging you and helping you stop these phishing attacks from getting through. Thank you again for your time. Bye.